Hey guys, what is going on? This is Apple Tech. Now, before I actually begin the video, I want to let you guys know if my voice sounds funny anytime during the video, it's because I'm sick at the current moment, but still wanted to shoot this video out for you guys. So, just something I wanted to let you guys know. But back to the video. Today, we'll be taking a look or unboxing the HTC Evo V 4G from Virgin Mobile. Now, the reason this is a good plan in general or a good phone is because there's no contracts involved. So you don't have to be locked into a two year contract with one certain phone. Now, Virgin Mobile has tons of the latest phones on their website, which I will have linked in the description below if you are planning on checking one out. Now, before any unboxing, we have to take a look around the box to see what the phone is packing. It has a 4.3 QHD touchscreen mobile hotspot, a 5.0 megapixel camera and camcorder. Now the feature that stands out most from this device is that it has a 3D HD imaging, making your image 3D or making your videos in 3D, which I gotta say is a pretty interesting feature, but at the same time, hard to pull off on a mobile device in this certain time period. However, moving along, it has 3G and Wi-Fi compatibility. Moving right along, this device also is HDMI compatible, meaning you can connect the device to a computer and monitor any Thing that you want to blow the screen onto you can do it from there now taking a look at some inner specs on what this phone can handle it has a memory card slot which can go up to 32 gigs it also has a standby time up to 300 hours battery talk time is up to six hours which is fairly good you have a phone weight of 6.0 ounces which is not the lightest but all these features packed in puts on a pretty good weight. Now moving on to the unboxing portion of this video, you don't get too much in the package besides from the HTC Evo V 4G. So you get that and it looks pretty durable, I gotta say from first impressions. Besides from that, you get some instruction manuals, some warranty, things that you wanna read so you get a better understanding of the phone that you're actually using. You will be also greeted with the standard USB cord to charge and sync the device, as well as the brick so you can connect it straight to the wall. So now that we know what comes in the package, let's take a closer look at the device. Now on the front of the phone, you will be greeted with the front facing camera, the HTC logo, Right below that you have the touch capacitive buttons which is a home menu back and search. Now moving it to the right hand side of the device that's where you'll be greeted with the volume keys as well as the 2D and 3D switch. You also have a capacitive camera button which you can snap photos or start a video. Towards the top you will be greeted with the sleep button slash power button. On the side of that you have the headphone jack connection. Towards the back, you will be greeted with two cameras. Now, the reason it needs two is because it has that 3D HD imaging. You also will be greeted with two flashes as well. Now, towards the side of that, you have the HTC Virgin Mobile branding. Turning it to the left-hand side of the device, that's where you will find the port to charge it. Nothing else is on there. And towards the bottom and the top, you have two separate mics. Now, this phone's back is also detachable, meaning that you can access the battery and the SD card slot. So you can change it from an 8 gig to a 16 or even the highest being 32 gigs. Now, as far as an overall look of the phone, it looks pretty durable that it will handle a couple drops, scratches here and there. So guys, that was mostly the unboxing for the HTC Evo V 4G. Feel free to check out my previous unboxing an overview of the Galaxy S2 running Virgin Mobile as well so feel free to click on the video right now to check that one out or I will have a link in the description below if you're looking at this from your mobile devices now as far as the giveaway winner for the iPad mini that I had a week ago I will have the winner's name annotated on the bottom of the video as well as in the description so you guys can check that out and that's much gonna do it make sure to follow me on any of my social networks below check out my second and gaming channel which will all be in the description I hope you guys are having a great day and I'll catch you guys in my next video see you